Hey, it's Brian G. Johnson from MarketingEasyStreet.com. And you know, when we talk about web marketing today, one of the things that is so in, uh, important with your success is to be able to capture someone's attention, to be able to present your information in a way that is fun, exciting, professional, cutting edge, whatever your thing is, having great graphics can help, again, grab that attention and can help push you forward and drive traffic and get the results that you're after. And you know, for a long time, creating uh, top quality graphics, you know, you needed to go out and hire a designer or spend uh, hundreds of dollars and, and have very specific things in mind. That's no longer the case, thanks to some great online tools. Today you can get apps for your iPhone or iPad or maybe your Android device. You can use many online sites and one we're going to take a look at today is called Canva. Now I'm on Canva right now and this is actually a free site that you can sign up with, you can use. I haven't spent a thing with this site and I've created numerous cutting edge, really fantastic looking graphics and I want to show you just how I've done this in this tutorial of Canva. Now just yesterday I posted to my blog about a great WordPress service that I use called Manage WP and I was able to create this snazzy looking graphic in about three or four minutes. Now when it comes to using Canva you can use this service to create all kinds of graphics, pictures, social uh, images and whatnot. You can create blog headers, maybe you can want to create a uh, cover uh, image for Facebook and you can see we've already got a preloaded template ready to go and so on. So how do you use Canva? Well it's really really pretty easy. Let me show you oftentimes what I do. I might start with this uh, presentation which is like a template and here we can see the sizes 1024 by 768 and all I need to do is click on this and I will get a blank canvas or Canva if you like. And you can see here my design is untitled. I can share it straight to my Twitter account or I can share to Facebook. I can also download and to download I would use the link and publish button. So how does it work? Well first of all you'll see we've got all kinds of great uh, layouts already done. Different types of fonts and images and that works real real well or you can simply select a background. In this case I'm going to click background and you'll see I've got some uh, predefined backgrounds like if I click this then I will get that background in my design just as I've shown you here. Now you'll notice that these say free. If we continue to scroll down you'll see that some of the backgrounds are paid and that's how Canva makes money. I think it's an ingenious model. It lets everybody get in, play around, create great looking graphics and if you want something specific let's say you want to create a header for your blog and you want a rocket ship in it well you can search uh, hundreds and thousands thousands actually millions of graphics so let's search for a rocket and sure enough look at all the rockets we have so let's just say we want something like this we can uh, move it around we can uh, resize as we as we would want and need and that makes the process really really simple so like I said here we are in the different backgrounds I'm gonna also select uploads now you have the ability to upload your own pictures and images and that's what I've done I've got some pictures here that I've taken uh, knowing that you know I would do this kinda of thing I would create social graphics um, for my website for Facebook uh, headers, banners, all kinds of different things. And let's say I wanted to take this image here. Let's uh, let's actually start off again. I want to delete that. There we go. So we're blank. And as you saw, all I needed to do to delete was hover over and we get some options. So here I'm going to select this image that I've uploaded. And you can see there it is. Uh, the image is in our palette. Now we need to work with the size and whatnot. And, and what's really nice is we can crop we can move the image around, we can get really what we want. And I want this kind of sun that I'm kind of casting, it kind of looks like I'm some crazy wizard. I'm gonna go ahead and hit crop. And when I do that, it might take a minute. Now, this service is in beta, and sometimes the site, you know, it, 
it's it's a little slow and there's probably thousands and thousands of users using it and because of that it can take a, a little bit of time and whatnot so I'm gonna kinda crop this as I as I see fit and I kinda want the Sun there we go that's kinda what I'm looking for let's get a little bit of the mountains that's great so I've cropped the section that I want to use and now when I'm done all I have to do is hit the check mark I have cropped and I'm good to go now again if I don't like what I've done I can always hit delete I can start over I can select a predefined background like I showed you but right now I'm in with this uh, image so again think about when you're out with your friends when you're out with your family when you're off hiking maybe take a picture of clouds or a blue sky and you can just throw some text over the top and create a great social uh, image that you can share so the next thing we want to do is we're gonna kinda just pull and we're gonna get this picture in the the background here right so that's pretty good and there's our, our image right there. So you can see uh, we really have a, a lot of power with this tool. Now, one of the things I really like too is uh, I can take multiple different images and I can move those around, right? And I can size them as I want. Maybe I put this here or I put it over here and this isn't the greatest example, but it makes it really easy to use multiple images layer them on top of each other you can crop you can resize and that's pretty darn awesome um, let's go ahead and go back to the home page I'm gonna click Canva and I wanna show you you can actually see some of the different images this is what I created yesterday right and specifically you know think about you know maybe pointing up towards that blue sky if you wanna capture yourself in the image you can do that and then you can use something like this to uh, post to your blog to grab attention and whatnot now I kinda use silly uh, humor in my marketing that doesn't mean you need to do that and if, in fact you don't have to even put yourself in the graphic if you don't want to remember you can choose a lot of different background colors maybe you just want a green background right um, let's st start in here again and it's really really quite easy let's start one more time let me show you how to add text so we're gonna start off with a background we're gonna uh, select this right here and to add text you just click well text and I wanna add a title so I'm gonna say this is an awesome example right now I'm gonna click out of there I'm gonna select again and I'm going to kind of drag this in the way I want and then after I've done that I can move this around anywhere I want and if I click on it again you'll see we have a tremendous amount of awesome fonts all ready to go like maybe you're going to do something that's like double agent secret kind of military thing you can uh, select this black ops font or maybe you want something uh, more like this diplomatic uh, awesome example uh, you can resize you can color I think this would look good with a white color the font right uh, it's a little too big so let's reduce the font to maybe 32 still a bit big and there's an example of the site seem to be a little slow but pretty darn good for free and just really powerful tool that you can play around with you can do so many different things with this and again remember you can come in you can select your own custom size let's say you want to make a, a header for your site and you need you need the header to be 900 pixels by 180 you can just plug those in you can hit design and now you've got a clean palette ready to roll here's the size you're gonna want and maybe you're gonna start with a, a kind of a background right so you're gonna come in and you're looking for a specific kind of uh, background for your header this is kinda cool maybe something like this right 
check out this image. This is probably, it's a dollar, and talk about a great graphic. You know, it's got a highway, perfectly centered, blue sky. Maybe, you know, um, you, you drop in some text here, like, you know, it's not about the destination, but rather the journey. And this is what's possible with Canva. Hey, Brian G. Johnson from Marketing Easy Street, I hope you found this tutorial to be helpful. I hope you found this information to be of value. And if so, I'd really appreciate it if you're on my blog, if you'd hit the like or share button. Right below this video, I'll have some sharing buttons that you can use that will spread the word and help get this awesome information out to the people. Hey, Brian G. Johnson. Have an awesome day. Talk to you soon.